everybody so today to kind of keep things different on my channel I decided to do kind of a clothing haul I don't buy a lot of clothes if I'm honest and with being and at a weight that I'm not happy with I definitely don't buy a lot of clothes because I don't want to buy a lot of clothes that really I don't want to stay in that size if that makes sense so I have purchased some things though and I want to share them with you because I've lost two stone and I feel like it's time to wear did I kind of pick up a few little things that I feel a bit more confident in because I kind of feel like I've been living in baggy jumpers and leggings forever and yeah I'm feeling a lot better about the way I look so I have stuff to show you from all over the place and I have forgotten something so I'll go and grab that and we'll get on so excuse the makeup I've just done the five minute makeup challenge I have put a bit more mascara and eyeliner on but pretty much left everything else the same because yeah it's okay it's not too bad <laughs> I think I'm pretty pleased with how it went overall except that I had an epic fail with the eyeliner but you'll have to check that video out if you want to see what I'm talking about so I'm just kind of stacking everything up here but this is going to be all over the place because I kind of just have to tackle it how it's kind of stacked at the moment um so the first couple of things are from Asda I did pick up some bras I'm not going to show them in this video I got one for two pound and two for four pound and I'm really pleased with them I'm wearing one now and it's very comfortable yeah so <laughs> Yes, not sharing that, but um, yeah, Asda bras are very nice. And I also picked up these. Now I picked up some pajama bottoms, but I think they're in the wash. But I picked them up in an 18 to 20, which is kind of the size I was in, and they're too big. <laughs> they kind of slip down, but they do have a drawstring on the waist, so that's okay. And they're nice and fleecy and warm, so I'm I'm not too bothered. That's okay. I can handle that. Um, pajamas and leggings have been pretty much the only things that I've been living in really. But anyway. See, I waffle too much. I'm going to try and keep this under 15 minutes. So the first thing I want to show you is these slippers. Not very exciting. Um, these were £6 at Asda. I had some panda ones. I've only had them a year. But they've started to fall apart at the seams, which is really a shame. Because I do like them. I've kept them. And I'm going to stitch the front. But they've lost some of like the insole. Um, but I'm going to keep them for when I'm kind of doing stuff in the house. And just like doing cleaning the yard and stuff. So, But these were £6. And they're really comfortable. And they're fleecy lined. And they're nice and warm. And I really like them. And then another thing from Asda. Yeah, two things from Asda I've got to show you here. I got this coat. Now this is a pea coat. And that's not because of the colour. But a pea coat apparently is a 60s style coat. And I'll insert some footage of me kind of showing it here for you. Um, just because it's a bit difficult to show on camera. But it's this green sort of quite fluffy material. It's very unusual. I don't know what it is, but it came in green and pink, but apparently the pink was like more of a salmon than a baby pink. And it's beautiful mint colour. The family's just arrived. I'll be right back. Okay. So, that was four o'clock and this is now nine o'clock. So it's been quite some time since I've been sat here and hopefully I don't look too bad. Uh, probably not got a great deal of makeup left on. <laughs> been doing... A lot of work in the house, got lots of pictures put up, got some shelves put up, got lots of DIY done, tidying, the house is lovely, I'm very happy, pitched myself back into my bra, can't show that bit, <laughs> so got lots done, but this is me as I am, um, take me or leave me, uh, there you go, and I was, t I was talking about this lovely coat, <sighs> amazing, I don't, what material is it? I'm actually, do you know what? I'm going to look at the label and find out what it's made. It's 90%. Oh, that's the lining. Oh, it's polyester. I'm going to stop waffling. This is just a lovely coat. It's kind of fluffy. I love it. And it's such a pretty pastel colour. And Alec wasn't sure about it at first, but it does look really nice on. And it looks really good with leggings. And it's really, it's an 18. Um, but somebody had actually brought this back. It had been £34 and it was down to 14 And then the lady was putting it out. And what happens at Asda sometimes is if they just have like one item, like one size of one item left in the sale, then they'll mark it down further. So this was actually £12 instead of 34 which is a huge bargain. It's got lovely lining and it's got nice pockets. And I just absolutely love it. I like things that are a little bit different. So I like that this is an unusual colour. And it's an 18 so I'm hoping to be back down to a 14 or 16 come Christmas. Um, but it doesn't matter because I always get my coats two sizes bigger anyway. Especially winter coats. So you can like put nice big jumpers underneath and layer up underneath your coat. So I don't care. 
I really love it and I'm not getting a huge amount of wear out of it now though I have worn it once or twice to go down the post office but come the winter I'll definitely be wearing that a lot. So the next item I'm going to show you, actually I'm going to show the, these shoes from Sainsbury's and if you follow me on Instagram you've already seen these. These had been, I think it was, I know it was definitely over £20. I think it was £22 at Sainsbury's and I actually got these in the sale for £6. Can you believe it? I was so excited. They're so lovely. They were hidden behind a bunch of other shoes just hung at the back by themselves in my size just waiting for me to come and pick them up. So they're like a plimsoll really, a trainer plimsoll kind of thing. I love this cream sole against the black. I really like that and it's got like the black line then it's got all these kind of lovely studs here and then the laces are actually ribbons and then it's playing on the inside and I got these because I was doing an event at the theatre and I was going to be running up and down stairs all day and doing a lot of running around so I wanted something that was really really comfortable and I hadn't even broke these in or worn them but they were so comfortable all day they didn't rub my feet and I haven't taken them off since I've been wearing them everywhere with jeans with leggings you name it I've worn these I even wore them with a maxi skirt. I absolutely love them. They're so comfortable. So I'm very excited about them. And they've got really thick soles. They're really good quality. So next time Sainsbury's have a sale, I'll have a look and see if they've got anything similar. And I'll probably pick some up because I'm really, really impressed with the quality. Next item is from ASOS. <laughs> yes, I am behind here. I'm trying to find the top of it. I think it might be inside out. It's very difficult to tell. This was £42. What? So um, I got this in the ASOS sale and this is the tall range and this is what it looks like and it absolutely sticks out a mile <laughs> as you can see it is Cinderella blue oh, so pretty and it's kind of got this band that's got satin around the top it's very very soft at the top but then it goes down to this firmer sort of mesh and we had this big event at the theatre um, in Sunderland we get the theatre for one uh, I was so good at catching that there we get the theatre one night per year and it's like a, a children's singing competition and um, we host it basically my office me and my boss two of us together running around like crazy people Tony comes and helps me and then on the night time we have all the children performing for parents and teachers and anybody who's bought a ticket really over 2,000 people are in there and we put on this big event and then at the end I get to be on stage singing and swaying with the mayor and the mayoress and just really like singing along at the end we sang thank you for the music by Abba at the end it was fantastic, it was a fantastic night and I wore this under a dress that I already own and it made it super poofy and Tony loved it, she said it looked great um, and it's just a beautiful colour and yeah I love it but this would also look nice how I want to style it when I've lost more weight is to wear it over like a midi skirt and then put a wide belt around it like maybe with a white shirt and yeah I think it'll look really cute and I got it in red as well but I think I'm sending the red one back but I love the blue and it, it goes perfectly with that dress so that's that. Not a cheap item but um, definitely something to keep forever really. It's a, I would say it's a key piece for something for you know if you're going to an event or if you're going to a wedding it would look really nice. I like that kind of thing so I got that. Um, the next thing from ASOS, I've had this for ages. I actually got it before Christmas and I hadn't worn it because I wasn't very well and things were happening with Millie and everything and I basically just kind of folded it up and put it with my clothes to put away and I paid £27 for it and then literally two weeks later in January it went in the sale and it went down to I'm th pretty sure it was like £18 and then I got a 10% off the sale code so it ended up being £16 so I sent the full price one back because I still had the invoice and obviously it still had its tags on and then I sent for it again and got it for £16. So I saved over £10 and it was just I couldn't keep it. I just thought well what, it's all it's got its tags on. I've got 28 days to return it so I'm well within return period so I'm definitely going to return it and order another one so I did. And anyway I'm waffling but it's a maxi cardigan so I can't show you the full length but it's lovely really nice I quite like this kind of thing where you can kind of see through it 
But this, I can't really show you a great deal. It's just a maxi cardigan. And it's just long and black and it does have buttons on it. So, I can't, you can button it up and it basically just goes all the way to basically the floor. It goes to my ankles. It's really, it's just so long and it's lovely and soft. And the idea of this is I wear a lot of like cat suits or all in one kind of suits, kind of look like leggings because I wear tops over them. But um, when I have the meeting on, it's actually happening next week, I want to wear my cat suit and then put a shirt over the top with my little waistcoat and then wear the cardigan and then some long statement necklaces. So I just thought something like that, like a long cardigan. For me, this is kind of a staple piece of my wardrobe that I've wanted for a long time. I used to have one before, but it kind of fell to pieces because I'd had it for like 20 years or something. Um, yeah, so this is a staple piece for me because I like that long cardigan look where it, I think it just looks really quite classy and I think especially if you're a little on the larger side it can hide a multitude of sins but I just think that it looks great when you layer it with different pieces and next thing I've got one thing from the Disney shop so I might as well show you that now and I am obsessed with collecting these bags I know, I'm a crazy bag lady these are the shopper bags from the Disney store and this is actually from the new Cinderella movie, so this is not like standard Cinderella. But it's Cinderella and we all know I love Cinderella. So I had to get it and I just thought it was really, really pretty. And then on the side when you do have it all opened up is shoe, glass slipper, which I thought was really pretty. And these are just great. I love these shopper bags. I've got, I don't know, I, I would hate to tell you how many I've got, but I think I've got about eight of them now. I always pick them up in different designs. They're really collectible. I really love them. I'm a huge Disney fan and they're just great because they're so strong. And whenever I'm going shopping, I just pop, fold one of these up, pop it into whatever I'm using or I just carry the bag itself. Um, when you put the bottom in, you can actually fold it over so you can just carry it in your hand. But I like to just take one of these with me when I pop to the shops because they're really strong and sturdy and you can get loads in them. Yeah, and I don't like paying for carrier bags. So, <laughs> so I've got that. And then the rest of the stuff I think is from yesterday when we went out. So we went out because Alec got a new job. And we went out to get him some new clothes um, for his new job. So we had a bit of a look around the Metro Centre and I haven't been since last summer. So it's like nearly come up to actually a year. Um, it's about 10 months since I've been, so it was quite exciting. Got to go to the big Primark, very exciting. I love Primark. So I've got some things from Primark to show you. Actually, just two things, because I didn't get much. Um, we did get Tony some plimsolls. We got Tony a jumper from H&M. And that was it. I got um oh I got a belt and I haven't got a tape to show you but I will put a photograph on Instagram. It's just a black belt and then you know how the old Batman logo is like yellow? I don't know if anybody's familiar with the old Batman, the original 60s Batman logo from the original TV series. It's got that as the belt buckle and I just thought it was so cool. But I will try and do an outfit of the day with that in because I've got an idea for that too. But the things from Primark that I got, I got a t-shirt. Okay, so we went in and there's this amazing Harry Potter t-shirt and they didn't have my size, I was devastated. And it's basically the Marauders map. And if you're a Harry Potter fan, you'll know what that is, but it was very exciting, it was white and it kind of had the different locations on it and it actually had like back print and front print. I don't like things when it's kind of like, especially that, because it had DTL all over it and then if it had a plain back, it would have ruined it, but they didn't have my size. And anyway, I found something else and I was just holding a few things up and looking and Alec went, it's Rex. I just like turned around, saw it and just threw the t-shirts back on and I was like, right, I'm having that one. I don't care about any other t-shirts in the shop. I have to have that one. So if you know me, you may know Rex is my favourite character from Toy Story. Forget Woody, forget Buzz. Who cares? You just need Rex. He should have a movie of his own. How can you not love the face? Of course I'm not forgetting Woody and Buzz. Tony's in shock. I absolutely love the Toy Story movies, love all of the characters, but Rex has always been my favorite. I have a cushion, I have a, a large stuffed Rex, a small stuffed Rex, and a couple of plastic ones. And I'm just obsessed with Rex. He's just so cute and he's so frightened of everything. And oh, oh hi Rip. So yes, Primark finally have recognized the wonderfulness of Rex and I have a t-shirt to honour him. 
So I'm very, very excited. And you might all think I'm very weird, but I really don't care because I absolutely love Rex. And I got very excited when I saw that T-shirt. <sighs> I know, it's sad, isn't it? But I can't wait to wear it with some leggings and my shoes. And then the only other thing that I got from Primark was these super cute plimsolls because in the summer, I live in jelly shoes and plimsolls. My feet can sometimes swell up quite badly. Um, my feet get very hot and I find it very difficult um, just to deal with the heat in general anyway because it tends to flare up my IBS, my asthma, I have troubles breathing and it's it's a lot, I have a lot of problems with hot weather. Um, yeah, so, but I'm not gonna waffle. I got these shoes and I wanna get them in black now. I kind of wish I'd got them in black but I didn't, I just got the cream and these were six and I think the t-shirt was eight. Um, but I think I wanna go back and get the black ones. But this is what they look like, they're basically just lacy and you can see through. I just think if you put on some really cute, nice sort of nail varnish under there, like some ni nice pretty sort of spring colours or pastel colours or even like little ankle socks would look super cute with it because you can see through them but not too much. And I just love it. I definitely want to get the black ones. But I just thought the cream ones were really perfect for spring, summer to wear with lots of things. They'd look great with maxi skirts. Look just as good with jeans and leggings and things. So that's those. I think they're really pretty. And I think I might put some ribbons in as laces rather than the laces. I also totally forgot. I got this. This t-shirt. Um, from Despicable Me and I only recently saw the films and I absolutely love them both and it's this t-shirt and it says it's so fluffy and then I forget this character's name but it's a little girl and then that's the unicorn and in the film she says it's so fluffy I'm gonna die <laughs> but when she says this line she goes it's so fluffy <laughs> and I absolutely love it that's when he wins it at the fun fair and it's huge picture and it's so soft it's such a soft t-shirt so I'm actually going to be wearing this for bed um, and again I said this is from Primark I've took the tag off um, but I think it was about six pounds five or six pounds and it's just worth every penny because I love it <laughs> and this is what I say about Ripley I say she's so fluffy so it's kind of one of my catchphrases that I use for Ripley so we thought it was really funny. So I'm going to wear this tonight and yeah I think it's really cute so I wanted to quickly share that with you. So that was from Primark and then the last few things are from H&M. So I just picked up some like a, a basic really. This is just a white long length cami. I actually picked this up in an extra large. I tried the large on and it felt really good and it was a lovely fit, but I got the extra large because I just wanted a little bit more room. And sometimes some of these like sort of, this sort of material, sometimes they can wash in a little bit, so. And it's a long length one. And I just really wanted it for layering purposes to go like under things. So I'm not too bothered about the size. I just wanted some comfort. And then in the sale, I picked up, um, oh. Do you know something? I totally forgot. The top that I'm wearing is from Sainsbury's. It's from the men's section and it's an XXL, so it's like literally huge and it's really long. Um, but it's got nice long sleeves and it was £3.50 in the sale. And I just like it. It's so soft and I love wearing it around the house. I feel really cosy and comfortable and it's got nice long sleeves and I've probably got stains on because I've been doing work, but there you go. But yes, and then I've got these leggings on, which I'm going to insert a picture because they're on my legs <laughs> but um these are from H&M and they were five pounds in the sale and I just love Mickey Mouse so I had to have those leggings and they're really really cute and so comfortable I got the large and they're too big really but I just wanted comfort <laughs> plus if they wash in they're okay the next thing that I got is is a pair of tracksuit bottoms actually I don't own any tracksuit bottoms well I do yeah, that's a lie. I own some cropped ones that I wear for Zumba, but they're all kind of bobbly because I wore them for Zumba for like over a year. And then I've got some Barbie ones, which I haven't yet to wear because they're part of a tracksuit and I've got the jumper and the trousers and I absolutely love them. They were like a collection with ASOS that sold out like just straight away. Um, yeah, I'm a bit nervous of wearing them, <laughs> but I will wear them just at some point. But anyway, I got these and it just says Brooklyn down the leg and it's gathered at the bottom 
with like a thick band there and then it's got like a drawstring waist which is just as well I picked these up in a large and they're seven pounds from 14 and now I tried a large on like end of last year and they would not fit me they were so tight and so uncomfortable and I was like so devastated because I was like oh no even a large HM <laughs> won't fit me. I put these on and they were even loose on me. They looked great on my legs. They weren't too tight. I really liked it. They were loose around the waist. I had to tighten the drawstrings. So I was very, very excited. Um, I just wanted some tracksuit bottoms because I don't have any to like, like, I'm quite happy to walk down to Horton with tracksuit bottoms on and some trainers and a t-shirt. And I find that really comfortable. Just throw a, like a denim jacket on. I like the way tracksuit bottoms look. I just, I don't know why. I haven't had a pair in so long, really. I mean, I used to wear the ones that I wore for Zumba, but they've just become so taddy. And they're bright pink, and it's kind of like wearing things to go with them. I think you can't go wrong with, like, a standard black pair of tracksuit bottoms. And they're so comfortable. And I've had H&M tracksuit bottoms in the past, and they wash lovely. So I wanted to pick some of these up and just have some comfort. I can wear them around the house. I can go shopping in them. And I thought £7 was a great price. And then the last thing I got, which is the last thing I'm going to show you, I didn't even try on, so I have no idea what it looks like. But I got it in a large, and it was full price, and it was twelve ninety nine. And I think it's just going to be amazing on. It's this jumper. I'm so excited. Look at the print. It's My Little Pony. It's just... Hundreds of My Little Ponies. And some of them are slightly peach and some of them are slightly mint. And it's a long sleeve jumper. And it's so soft. But what I love about it is it's this fabric where you can actually kind of see through. And I should have got a black cami and I'm kicking myself now that I didn't. I thought it would look really great off the white cami but I think it looked great off the black as well. But it's just... Longer at the front slightly than the back. I think it'll kind of go down. The back will certainly go down, I would say, just over my bottom. So it's just a nice length. And it's actually really quite big. It's got lots of stretch about it, but I'm not going to need to stretch it because it's, it's really big anyway, even though it's a large. So I can't wait to try it on. And I will try and do an outfit of the day. I'm going to try and do more outfit of the days. Now I'm starting to feel a bit more confident about my body. Um, but oh, it's so pretty. It's a round neck. and I just fell in love with the pattern and I was like, oh no. I'm not even going to try it. I don't care. I just love the pattern. So I got that. I like my little pony things because this is the original pony. All style ponies are the best. So yes, it's lovely and it feels so soft and I don't know. I'm just so excited to like try it on. And that's it. So I hope you've enjoyed something a little bit different from me. Don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe as always. And um, yeah, I've been Spacey's number one girl and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys. Thank you.